don't know how, because he didn't touch his hands. Well, I have no idea. Hey folks and welcome to another episode of Gift of the Gap. Today I'm with Kevin Quantum from Edinburgh Magic Fest. I knew I was meeting Kevin today 10, at 10 o'clock for a couple hours, but I did not know what we were gonna do. So as a magician, I wanna make sure that um, there's a lot of mystery and elements of mystery to what I do, and that has to start usually even before someone comes into the theater. So meeting Gav today, the same principle applied. I wanted him to, to feel mystery before he ever even met me. Then we had four phases in the process. The first phase was me demonstrating to Gavin some, some tricks that I do when I'm performing close-up magic. I think the cube's in one place, it's actually in. Yeah. So as that goes to the pocket, that can sneak it under, but doesn't explain how they went the man. The second phase was teaching Gavin how to do a magic trick, which he was then going to later perform. The teacher will know that is one that you're going to take with you and out to the streets of Edinburgh and perform it as well. Rest with your left hand. Now I want you to grab my left wrist as well with your other hand. That's good, just give me a little bit of freedom. Three, two, one, shut your eyes. Okay, you just feel the wrists, feel the wrists, make sure there's nothing going on either side of them. Mm -hmm. Make sure they do not come together at any point at all either. You might feel some small movements, but don't be too alarmed by that. Just keep your eyes nice and tightly closed. Then in a second, I'm gonna ask you to open your eyes and do that. Three, two, one, open your eyes now. Scroll it down. The uh, third phase was actually getting him comfortable um, controlling people's attention and approaching people he'd never met before and getting them to do something that uh, he wanted them to do, which in our case was making them look at something, make it look at something that, that either didn't exist or yeah. did exist. In a second you're just going to jump away, point to the castle and make sure people watch at the same time. <laughs> right, so um, the couple there that uh, we were just walking away um, did uh, did nothing. <laughs> yeah, tell us how you're feeling. Uh, nervous. Yeah, could, nervous. Why, why do you think you're feeling nervous? I don't know what it is actually. It's the fact that you're maybe fooling people a little bit. I think. Oh. I did a little wow and they had a look. That was successful, Gavin. Well done. And um, the final phase was then getting Gavin physically out there on the streets of Edinburgh meeting people he had never met before and doing a trick that he had just learned one hour ago and uh, and he stormed it. <laughs> Hold on to my wrist. It's alright. Nice and tight. Not that tight. Closer. A little closer. A bit tighter. A bit tighter. A little bit looser. A little bit looser. A little bit looser. I'm going to ask you to shut your eyes. Okay. Three, two, one. What do you want to do? Loosen a little bit. He's just listening to the train in the background. What did you listen? You'll hear the sound of the trains going past. You'll also maybe hear the traffic above. And what one you do? Open your eyes in three, two, one. See the phone has gone from here. It's <laughs> <That's> great. <laughs> Yeah, don't, don't tell mom how to do it. <laughs> yeah, I'm still thinking about Are how we did it. <laughs> he threw it to himself from one side to the other. How? I have no idea. I have no idea how we did it. Today's been a bit of a... An interesting start to the day, that's for sure. <laughs> the first time I met Kevin, he somehow managed to get a card in under my watch without me realising. And I've never... I've, I've seen magic happen on, online and on Darren Brown on TV, but I've never actually had somebody really get me. And so... It was really interesting, I can't wait for the festival, but tell us everyone what it's about. So the Magic Festival is an eight-year-old festival. It happens in Summer Hall and the Festival Theatre and other venues around the city. It starts on the 30th of June, which is literally only a week or two from the point at which this has been filmed. It runs till the 8th of July. And if you've never seen magic before or you want to see some of the best magicians in the world, then, uh, then do check it out, magicfest.co.uk. Thanks very much for, for this morning, Kev. Yeah, been... before we finish, can I do something that's a wee bit outside of my comfort zone as okay. well, too, with you on camera just now as well? Yeah. And I'm going to spin you around this way. There is a coin, it's a 50 pence in his hand. I'm going to move you there. Grab it really tight, turn your hands this way around. Make sure it's up in the air for me like that, really high up. That's great, a bit higher. That's perfect. After three, we're going to make a jump from here over to this hand after three. <laughs> three, two, one, and open your hands. Open this hand. Going around to the camera for me for a second. The coin didn't jump, but Gavin, are you aware what happened there? No. Nope. Um, look at the camera, and I will just show you. <laughs> <this>. Which I will. <laughs>